Welcome to Tesla Super Destinations, where we review Tesla's charging infrastructure and get to know the cool people there. Today we're running up that hill towards the supercharger in Morgan Hill, California. Let's get charged up. Hello, this is Blue Leader and we're here in Morgan Hill, California, where they have a total of 14 superchargers. I just want to thank all of you guys for hanging out with us on our road trip and uh, you know what, it's time to give gratitude to you guys. Uh, to show your gratitude back, just hit that like button. There's a subscribe button, it really help, helps keep momentum going. And if you know anyone that wants to hang out with us, make sure you uh, share the content with them. So here we go with my initial impressions, initial thoughts. First thought, I'm in another typical outdoor strip mall parking lot. But the good news is uh, we're target adjacent, so your target needs will be met when you're road tripping along the 101. Initial feelings. I've got a pretty good feeling, good vibe around here. It's really quiet, safe, and um, you're not going to be without amenities. So good vibes, good feelings. Initial concerns. No concerns whatsoever. You're really close to the 101 freeway, and like I said, you could change the name to this particular supercharging location. It doesn't have much of Morgan Hill's personality. It has that outdoor strip mall, basic parking lot supercharger, supercharger uh, vibe to it. So anyways, thank you so much and stay tuned for the review. Let's give our guest Carol our ear so she can tell us about the area. So when someone is supercharging here, what could they do? Well, um, I actually just got done doing yoga, so I do yoga. Um, a lot of times I'll get my nails done if that's um, due. Uh, I'll go shopping at Target and then I live close enough so um, a lot of times I'll drop off the car and then um, walk home, grab my dogs and then walk back and then we all hop in there when the charging is done. Excellent. Mm -hmm. I'm wondering are there any other selling points for this supercharger besides the ones you mentioned? Sure. I mean you can go and eat over at um, what is it Mr. Pickles, there's the um, there's Starbucks, you can go shopping at Dick's, um, of course there's always um, the makeup store over here. So there's all sorts of things, um, even Pilates. If you're into Pilates, you can go do Pilates. That sounds fantastic. Lots to do around yes, here. Yes, for sure. If there were no chargers here, would you still come to this lot? Yes. For the reasons I mentioned, definitely I signed up for the yoga because of the proximity and I could um, kind of kill two birds in one stone. One full star for chargers, 14 of them at 72 kV 24-7. Half a star for bathrooms, 498 feet away inside Target. A full star for safety, well-lit outdoor parking. Food and beverage gets a full star because there's a market, local eateries, fast food, and coffee. Cool Factor scores a half a star. This is your basic outdoor strip mall stop. The Morgan Hill Supercharger in California gets a 4.0 TSD rating. Non-rated noteworthy mentions half a mile from the 101 freeway Cochrane Road exit. Let's give our guest Carol the final word. What was the coolest thing someone has ever done for you, Carol? For Mother's Day, my son is in college. I got a notification that I had a DoorDash delivery. Um, now, anybody who knows me knows I'm a pig, so I was hoping for food, but I got some beautiful flowers. I probably paid for the flowers, but it was a nice gesture. <laughs> <laughs> who do you admire the most, Carol? Probably my best friend. Her name is Christy. What do you admire about Christy? You know, Christy's a very well-rounded person. Anybody who knows me knows I always am um, kind of in awe of her. And while she's extremely smart, she's also very grounded. You know, you ask her a question and she answers in a way that educates you. 
but um, also involves you in the answer as well. Her tenacity, I just really ad admire a, a lot. Do you have any final words of wisdom for the people out there? My Tesla is nine years old. I wanted to get rid of it just because it was the oldest of ours and we ended up keeping it and I'm so thankful we kept it. Number one, the gas prices are out of this world and so this has saved us so much money. It's just a really nice car and after nine years this thing has really held up really, really great. That sounds really good. Mm -hmm. You know what, Carol, thank you so much for your time. We'll see you later, okay? okay thank you. Congrats, you made it to the end. Comment your electric thoughts and share with your circle of trust. Thanks for letting us supercharge your Tesla destination. See you at our next super destination. What do you think the next Tesla product should be? I don't know, maybe like a little crossover that is the Subaru-ish as well as luxurious inside.